Sadly, bullying is a problem at schools across the country. But a Titusville area family says the bullying at one school has reached a boiling point. Matt Mathias spoke with that family tonight. Matt. Sean and Jen, the attack on the victim at Titusville High School was captured on film by bystanders. While we can't show you those videos tonight, they're a disturbing reminder of a reality of many young people today. A video circulating online shows a Titusville student being attacked last Monday by a fellow student, some say is a bully. The next day, two friends of the victim defended him, taking matters into their own hands and responding with an attack of their own. Some 10 bystanders could be seen and heard telling the bully, hit him more and hit him harder. It's just been horrific. I want it to stop. I don't know how to make it stop. It's a problem that the victim has allegedly dealt with for years. His grandmother says he's developed anxiety and depression from his trauma. Family members saying that the school isn't nearly doing enough to stop this. He doesn't like to talk about those things. It causes him anxiety and nobody wants to feel that. So that's why he doesn't, he didn't even tell us, his parents, that this had happened to him. Many victims of bullying often have thoughts of suicide, which has this grandma concerned. I don't want to see another child not make it through this, and I especially don't want it to be my grandson. The Titusville superintendent responded in a statement saying, We take bullying, cyberbullying, and other forms of aggression seriously, and it is not tolerated. The intent of every investigation is to ensure all students feel safe in our buildings. We need to stress the importance of bystander reporting that will help improve the overall culture and climate of our schools. All three students involved in the fighting were given unnamed consequences by the school. Meanwhile, the victim was given permission to continue learning online for the rest of the school year. Now, the victim's mother added that the bystander who, the, all the bystanders who filmed and watched from the side should also be held accountable as well.